Disclaimer. The food items being reviewed and tasted were all bought out of pocket by the GOAT, or the greatest of all Tito's, and none of which were provided by the food provider or restaurant and topic. All comments and reactions in this video are genuine and that the food provider or restaurant had no input or influence whatsoever. As always, the opinions and reactions expressed in this video do not necessarily reflect the opinions of all Tito's or uncles around the world. Possibly a few, but definitely not all. So here we are again with another food review. So nyo, we are not in the usual setup na medyo madilim. Um, I just saw this fresh out of yung ad, ad me. As you can see with the tape, Pizza Hut. Uh, that they have a new product that I want to test out. Um, disclaimer, this is not a sponsored video, nor this was nor was this sent out to me by Pizza Hut. I bought this out of my own money. And we are here to review their Melts product line. So, as of this recording, they have four flavors. Um, and we are going to try all of them out. Let's go and see if it's worth it. Now, if you order directly from their website, from the Pizza Hut website, you could get those. You could get these for around two hundred forty-nine each, uh, plus sixty-five pesos uh, delivery charge, which would bring you to a total of one thousand sixty-three for all four variants. If you go through the uh, grab route, you could get it for two fifty-nine each. But if you are using the Grab Unlimited um, subscription service, the total came to about 1,050-ish. All right. So let's go give each of these a try. So according to their website, they have four official flavors. The Hawaiian Supreme, their Meat Lovers, the Four Cheese and Mushroom, and their Double Bacon. So what I have here with me is all four variants. Let's go test it out. When you order it from Pizza Hut, when I ordered it from Grab, rather, it came with a hot sauce pack each. So let's see. Let's try to guess what these flavors are as I open the box. Oh. It comes with... Oh, marinara sauce. It comes with marinara sauce. So this is this is what it looks like. I am guessing this is the meat lovers. Yeah. So parang ang itsura niya when you look at it, parang ang itsura niya is like yung fajita ba? Ano ba sa ano? Sa army navy. It and dating sa akin, when you look at it, it's like half a pizza na thin crust tapos tinope. And I think that's what it is. Okay. I'll have a bite without the sauce first. Cheers. Ang nila sa ako lang kaagad is ano eh. <clears throat> the Italian sausage, the ham, the cheese, and the crust kagad. Pero wala ko nalala sa tomato sauce. Baka wala. Parang wala. Let's try the marinara sauce. The marinara sauce gives it like a different a different depth kasi may kotin asim yung marinara sauce gives it a more pizza feel syempre it's pizza hot one more bite okay next stop it's hard to tell it looks like it's the double bacon. 
Or is this the mushroom and cheese? Let's see. We'll find out when you bite it. Right? It's a little, it's much greasier than the, it's much greasier than the first one that I got. But anyway. Mmm, okay. Yeah, I got the double bacon. Ito melts na na dapat sadya talaga wala ng ano. Kailang soft? Okay. Pag nilagay mo ng mayonnaise sauce, it, it brings it back to like a pizza feeling. Pizza plate, pizza tasting. Mm. That's their double bacon. Okay. Next up is their... Okay. Dahil may naligaw na pineapple. It is clearly the Hawaiian. I feel mo sabi na ino over sensual, ino ino over sensual, ah ino over sensationalized nila yung pagkaiba ng ah pagka dili ng tao sa Hawaiian. It's just pineapple. Doesn't destroy anything. You guys like sweet and sour dishes. I mean, if you're the type na ayaw nyo na sweet and sour, then okay, I get it why you don't want pineapple on your pizza. So this is their Hawaiian. Medyo na emphasize yung lasa niya because wala mong tomato sauce in, in this. Pero hindi mo masyadong napapansin yung pineapple because the ham is sweet already. So parang... The pineapple gives more of like more texture than the actual taste. It doesn't contribute too much to the taste. Kasi nga matapos na yung sweet ham. Let's try it with the marinara sauce. Okay. The marinara sauce changes it. Eh. Parang without the marinara sauce. Alam niyo yung nung bata kayo pag well, it, it, well maybe it's just in my household. Pero may mom pag nakachempo siya sa landmark or sa supermarket ng yung mga yung bloke bloke ng mozzarella cheese yung nabibili mo ng ganun no? mahal siya oo pero if you divide it into then sell it like individual chunks pwede mura siya tapos ang gagawin niya itotoast niya sa bread paglalagay siya ng mozzarella cheese ng ham tapos yung sa tinapa ilalagay lang niya sa oven toaster it it gives you that kind of vibe I'm still debating whether it's really worth 250 pesos. And last but not the least. Okay. There are four cheese. Medyo parang siksik tong cheese, four cheese nila. It feels like the heaviest among the three. It. You know, connoisseur. But this one has mu ah, it's four cheese and mushroom, so
Okay. Among the four, ito yung pinaka malasa. Maybe it's because of, obviously it's because of the cheese. If I can find it, I'll list down the types of cheeses that was used here. And again, if you put the, if you add the marinara sauce, it adds another layer, another depth of flavor. Into this melt. My overall thoughts on the pizza Hut melts. I'm kind of torn with the, the price point. When it's directly from Pizza Hut, it's 249. Getting it through Grab, 259. Um, you kind of get two slices of that melt thing, basically half a thin crust pizza. Siguro ting pang 12 inch or 14 inch. Uh, 14 inch, yeah. So if you get a whole pizza, kunyari, 500 for a whole pizza. Okay, that's not bad. For 249 pesos per order, it's not bad. But now having tried all four, parang yung pinakasulit sa kanilang apat would be the four cheese kasi nga makapal siya, may gut. But if you're talking about the taste and everything, they're all good. Um, not much of a fan of siguro nakukulangan lang ako because nga of walang marinara sauce but I think the the purpose of why pizza did it is separate nila is so that you can put in as much as you want kasi syempre sa panahon ngayon dami mga tao daling masaktan pag um, against the preference nila but yeah yeah, I think it's nice. It's a good idea that they separated the marinara sauce and they used it as a dipping sauce. Bang for buck, I guess. I mean, I think it's good. I think it's okay. It's not something that you... Pero pang baon, pang lunch, siguro it's good enough. Kaya nang sinang promo parang in the website, eh, you add 12 pesos, you get a drink. I don't think it's bad. So that's it. That's your Tito's honest review of Pizza Hut melts. Um, go test it out. That's it for today's video. Bye bye.